Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Hexaberry, and yes, I am back once again because today I have off work and what a what a better day to talk about this than my day off and I came out about last night or yesterday, I think, whenever this information came out for the Need for Speed Unbound Volume 2 update, which is filled with new content. Uh, and so I'm going to be showing the trailer in the background, um, but right now I'm just going to be talking about all the information that they show on the website right now, about all the, the new stuff that we're getting, new stuff that we're getting. Uh, I mean, we're getting some new stuff, but it's pretty lackluster. All right, it says Lakeshore Online heats up, provoke the cops into a thrilling high speed chase and stay ahead to make bank while your friends help knock the cops off your tail or take the heat off you for their own rewards. I'm not entirely sure how the cops are going to play out multiplayer, but we're getting cops in multiplayer for once, which is pretty cool. And then they say we're getting new cars and a new custom. So three new cars is what I would like to... Two. They, they word it horribly. Um, we're getting one new car. So the, the ultimate luxury is what they say is... It's still blocked out on their website. It says, you're looking at the world's fastest leather armchair. Perfect for your driving in the new hot laps found across the city and tour Lake Shore in the ultimate luxury. To make money, you gotta look the part. So what I'm assuming the fastest leather armchair is, it's probably gonna be another Bugatti or a Koenigsegg or something relatively fast because they say world's fastest leather armchair. Or, what I really hope they're not doing is releasing a gamer chair. I, uh, they say leather armchair and they have it blurred out. Surely it's a new car. Surely we're getting something worth our weight. Uh, but they haven't gone over all of the details yet. The update's coming out March 21st which is next Tuesday, which I have off that day, which I'll probably be live streaming the game. But they haven't gone over all of the details yet. We don't know about any balancing or anything. So this could possibly, it's either 50-50 chance, a gamer chair, or an actual piece of content that we deserve. Let's see what it's going to be whenever they reveal it. Uh, the next car they have is the Lotus Amira Balmain Edition, a skin of a car we already have so there's no point in looking at that and then the next car is an even bigger disappointment uh, something we thought that we would be getting in the base game uh, for free uh, as content when the game launched what is the Nissan Fair Lady ZG 1971 epic custom uh, that's pretty goofy wording in my opinion uh, but if that's the full title of the car, then so be it. And uh, this is an EA Play only exclusive. So you got to fork over your hard earned, you know, dollar money to EA like they don't have enough already. New ways to play. Now we're getting some new challenges. 40 new daily challenges, which are pretty good. I don't know if we're going to see the daily challenges recycle or repeat over the days but it'll give me something to do to hop on for for maybe four thousand dollars that they're gonna give me for completing a challenge which is gonna be nothing and then 15 new challenges i'm assuming we're gonna be getting challenges to unlock something else unlock the new you know smokes and stuff that are coming i'll go over that in a little bit uh new emotes and whatever whatnot New events and more. We're getting 30 hot laps activities. And so what I'm assuming these are going to be is going to be, you know, quick 30 to, you know, 45 second races just in little areas around the city. And we're going to have to post our best lap time for our friends and other people to beat. And then we're getting four new endurance events, which I'm assuming are going to be like 
the 20 highway races that we already have. Uh, we're getting four new ones, so that's pretty cool, I, I guess, if you like those. Two new Rumble playlists. I don't know what a Rumble playlist is. I'm assuming it's going to be a race filled with cops. Let's see. Um, and then two new race playlists, which are something we already have. And then we're getting an existing playlist refresh. So they don't really go into detail about that. Surely they'll release more information in the next few days. So these are the new rewards. We are going to show off our style in the streets of Lakeshore with new driving effects, stickers, poses, and more. Exactly what we've been asking for. Now I know a lot of people don't necessarily like the art style of the game. They don't like the, the cartoony effects. I like them. I didn't ask for more, but it's something apparently we needed. So freshen up your ride with new driving effects. Channel the spirit of the boxing bear, the little collectible among us fall guys looking dude that we get to run over in the map. And uh, beat all your 30 rival lap scores to unlock the new bear champ driving effect. Um, I guess that's what we needed. <laughs> Uh, and then master your driving by reaching 60 stars and flaunt your achievements with the Hey May driving effect. I don't know what that's going to look like, but it'll probably be okay, I guess. Now we're getting into the, the turbo content, the stuff that I've been asking for for so many months, dude. Four months and I'm finally getting the content that I want. New poses. Uh, let them know who you're facing with all the new poses. Surge to 90 stars and hot laps to receive the ghost pose and get the better of 20 rival hot lap scores to unlock the need coffee pose. Now these poses right here are very cool, very epic, and just very epic and cool. Um, I'm really thankful that they put the four months of time uh, into animating these poses because this is truly this is just what embodies Need for Speed. This is the backbone of Need for Speed Unbound. This is what everyone has been asking for. This is what is getting all of the new Need for Speed Unbound update trailer likes to over a million. This is exactly what we've been looking for. And I'm, I'm gonna cry tears of joy because this is just this is just amazing. This is great to see. I need a Capri Sun. And I'm gonna drink my Capri Sun. And I'm gonna have my Capri Sun. Nova wants some Capri Sun. He's walking out of the room. But yeah, um, I got my Capri Sun. Pacific Cooler. Um, but yeah, that's the uh, the new poses. Uh, and then the next piece of content that I'm truly excited for is uh, the new banner stickers for your character. Give your banner a facelift. Uh, six new banner stickers can be unlocked as you tear up the streets and control the chase, escaping cop chases across varying heat levels and helping other racers lose the cop. We'll land you some new banners to show off to the squad. The squad of four people that you can invite to your party and the other eight people that can join the race if they don't leave by the end of it. We need more people in our parties. Anyway, this is the next piece of content that we're getting is Keys to the Maps DLC, which removes content from the game if you're new. If, you, if you're new to the game and you haven't found all the, the stuff and, you know, did all the activities, 
uh, you can basically pay to win. Or pay to get money, I guess. Pay to do everything for you. Want to build your bank faster? Cut straight to the chase with the keys to the map unlock. Wait, how'd they word that? With the keys to the map to unlock the locations of all 260 collectibles, 100 bears, 80 street art, and 80, 80 billboards, and 160 activities for you to earn your rewards anytime you like. So if you're too lazy to do the only content in Free Roam, um, give them money. Give EA money, and they'll give you in-game money to buy 80 recycled cars with. Very cool. And then at the very bottom, we have Fury and Zen clothing pack. I don't know what Fury and Zen is. I don't know if it's an exclusive cool clothing brand that I've never heard of. I don't know if it's a content creator. I don't know who it is. I don't know what it is, but I don't care. Because this looks like zero drip at 0% interest that I don't have for it. Uh, some people might like it. Um, I, I don't really care much for it, but, uh, you get one top over jacket, one top under t-shirt, one bottom sweatpant, and one headwear cap. And that's about it. That's, that's the bottom of the, uh, the update. That's all I have to say. Um... Let's just hope that uh, we get something more entertaining next update. And uh, let's hope that we get some balance changes when they go over the full patch note. Until then, uh, I don't know what to do. Goodbye. I forgot to add this to the end of my video, but uh, if you like this content, subscribe. I will be live on uh, Tuesday when the update comes out. So. Uh, click the cool little bell it's um it's free subscribing is free liking the video is free commenting is free i mean it takes up some of your time a little longer than subscribing and stuff but at least subscribe because i want 1000 subscribers and that will get me paid goodbye outro 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 i think this will be my new outro this new feed is pretty funky i'm sorry slans please subscribe so i can buy a cooler car that is not boring i'd appreciate it if you did that share with your friends you won't fail the cringe test with hexaberries racing content subscribe